You don't look too happy, Theron. What is it? They were mounting a resistance. Locals, Imperials, they had resources, a plan, a base of operations. Miot was arranging to smuggle weapons. Gone. They're all gone. The Star Fortress over Bathawui vaporized every last trace, every last rebel, and then just moved on like it didn't matter anymore. I don't know what a Star Fortress is, but I assume it belongs to Arkin. Let's obliterate it. I love nothing more, but it's not that simple. Frankly, I've only just gotten up to speed. Bewanega was looking into it. Now he's busy trying to reach out to his fellow Bothans, so this falls on me. Crazy boy, Wawahuna. Star fortresses are battle stations, deadly and pervasive. Arkin's way of keeping the galaxy pliant. So many worlds we can't even contact because of these things. There are dozens, maybe hundreds. We tried everything to learn about their inner workings. Weaknesses, nothing. And now this. Right now they're suppressing, but that's just to bide their time. I feel it, Commander. Arkin's got a plan for those things. The kind of plan you don't recover from. Find a way to access one, and I'll tear it apart from the inside. I'd love to see that. Without the faintest clue of what we're up against, it's a massive risk. All right. We have to do something. I'll go too. Try to make heads or tails so we know how to deal with them. Let's not waste any time. Be right there with you, Commander. If it isn't the Alliance, Commander. Out here, slumming it with the Imperial trash. Just a little joke, my Jedi friend. Must be as weird for you as it is for me, all this working together. Look, we heard what you're getting up to. The massive risk you're taking for everyone. No one I respect more right now than you. Everything's prepped. Theron and a little fella are ready. Go kill us a Star Fortress, Commander. Thanks for dropping in. Setting a course for Alderaan. You think I'm stuffing me up? You're in for a treat. All right, Commander, we're here. We're ready to be dropped off. Ducked over one of the main observation towers. We should find a lift system in there that'll get you deeper inside. Not sure what's at the heart of this thing. Keep your guard up. I'll be in touch. Looks like you found a hub of activity. Stay on your toes. Getting some big power readings for the levels below you. You should look into it. Eternal Empire is placing locals in a forced conscription. Not much you can do, I guess. Thought you should know. Must be where all those sky troopers are coming from. Try not to wake anything up down there. Intrusion on sky trooper production level. Praetorian unit deployed. Failure. Hope they don't start mass producing those things. Great work. <laughs> Looks like their resource harvesting includes the local wildlife, probably arena fodder. Well, if you 
and wanted a sense of the scale of this place. There you go. Okay, you're in Power Central now. We need to do something about Ephemeris. See if you can patch me into its data cores. Ephemeris alert. Data center breach in progress. Security units ineffective. System uplink initiated. If I'm reading this right, Ephemeris beamed its core computing into one of those units. Interesting move. Creepy and interesting. Might give us a tactical advantage, actually. Taking it out could disrupt system protocols for a bit. Warning. Ephemeris data core compromised. Secondary core engaged. <laughs> Secondary data core failure. System failure. Deploying emergency backup unit. Engaging combat algorithm. Classification, night. Target ability, insufficient. Alert. Fatal system error. Nice work, Commander. Now we'll bypass that shield and... Welcome to my Star Fortress, Outlander. It will also serve nicely as your tomb. Can't get at the shield. Something remote. I have to rethink this. Mia, get a lift open. Sifting through everything you pulled from the Star Fortress, starting to get a better picture of what we're facing here. What are we looking at? Like I thought, the scope of all this is... Actually, forget what I thought. It's beyond anything I imagined. This friendly guy is part of a special order of knights called Exarchs. You kind of met one. Best I can tell, one of them commands each Star Fortress. That program seemed to be running things. What do they need a human component for? Maybe Arkin doesn't trust artificial intelligence. Other big piece I was able to work out. The fortress is powered by a massive sun generator, like on Zakul. We could use it to destroy the station. But according to energy readings, the reactor is protected by a remote bunker on the planet's surface. So we take out the bunker, then the reactor. It's a tall order. Not impossible, but we need ground forces and we don't have the personnel, unless... Mihat's been pulling together reports of distress calls, skirmishes, the idea being we'd eventually follow up on them. Here, these are a start. A handful of worlds under the threat of a star fortress, each with potential allies. Just a handful. You said there are hundreds of these things. This handful alone will be more than a handful, trust me. I say we focus on what we can for now. You've got to prove that helping us is their best possible option, which it is. They just don't know it yet. I got this alliance together, didn't I? 
People love me. I hope you're right. Wait, who knock me? Why, JJ, man? 